Rachel Ray and the doctors and promoting healthy eating habits for kids and had the chance to serve on our president and first lady, uh, their, only, their very own recipe that you made for them, which is amazing. So congratulations on that. And here to share a delicious dish to, uh, is the co-author of the Supernatural Kids Cookbook is Haley Thomas. So welcome, Haley. Thank nice you, to have you here. <laughs> Yeah, you started cooking at a very young age. How old were you? Because you're only 14. That's a young age. Uh, I've been cooking for as long as I can remember. I've always been in the kitchen uh, by my mom's side. And as I got older, I started learning how to make more complex dishes and really having fun experimenting with different foods. What? Well, speaking What's of, your, uh, you, your family is here. Yes, and they're sitting over there. Do you want to introduce us real quick? I know that's your dad and your yep, mom. Yep, my this dad, mom, and sister, Nia. Hi. Okay, Hi, wonderful. Guys. It's Hugh and, and Charmaine <laughs> there <laughs> flanking her sister. Hi. Hi, welcome. But we understand, yeah. though, that you were very instrumental in helping your father who had diabetes and you turned it around for him with your cooking. Yes. How did you figure that out at such a young age? Well, as a family, seeing all of the potential side effects from the diabetes medication, it was very scary and seems like it could make his condition even worse. So as a family, we came together and really did lots of research and trying to find ways to incorporate our favorite dishes into our life, but make it healthy as See, well. she did research. Kim Douglas does two she weeks does research. Two weeks she can solve any yeah. problem. I want to ask Dad, <laughs> Hugh, how are you feeling now? Are you still on medication at all? Oh, I'm on no medication. I feel awesome. I'm able to play some great soccer now. So I'm feeling good. Feeling you great. Should. And you seem like you've got a lot of pride in this little girl up here. Oh, so yeah. Um, Haley, she's been very inspirational. Um, she got her entire family involved in a lot of physical activity and just starting uh, eating healthier as a family. So she, right. she's very inspirational. And now, uh, please br bring. That's right. We're going to bring it in, and we um, now you've become uh, really good friends with Mrs. Obama, have you not? Yes, yeah. um, I've gotten the amazing opportunity to be around her several times. I actually got the chance to introduce her at the second annual Kids State Dinner. Um, and the previous year before that, my dish, um, my recipe was actually served at the White House to the President and First Lady, so. <laughs> wow, well, I have to give you props I'm sorry. Well, I have to go. Okay. So, Tell me what you're going to be making today. Okay, so today I'm making a barbecue sweet potato tortizza. Now, a tortizza is just a tortilla pizza, and it's super easy to make and really fun for the family to put together, too. Everybody's so. going over there now going, wow, there, I can eat, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, how is that delicious? So good. So good. Really good. Swap out rather than using regular pizzas as tortilla. Is yes. It so. This is not only healthier, but the creaminess from the sweet potato replaces the cheese. So Should cheese, yeah. Oh, okay. So if you just spread that out on here, no. and just yeah, make stand back, a Christine. nice, she knows what she's doing. Yeah, I know. I was she's a nice cool. layer, mm -hmm. and you can do as much sweet potato as you want. And sweet potatoes mm -hmm. are so beautiful and really, really healthy for you as well, but tasty too. Mm. Okay. Really, I probably should have asked you before I ate some. I'm allergic to a lot of foods. Is this um, is this chicken? No. So this is actually vegan protein. Oh. So I'm oh, vegan, and so is my family. Approved. I just heard Sophie singing. Yeah. Yeah. She's so happy. Oh. Oh. Why That's did a window break or something? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So um, after you spread out your sweet potatoes, you're going to add another layer of tortilla, and then you're going to press that down there. And then I want you to help oh, me yay. spread out some barbecue sauce on, on top. Here? Okay. Now you can make your own barbecue sauce or use whatever your favorite one is. I love making my own sauces, so throw something yeah. together and you have a homemade sauce. Then I'm going to add on some red bell peppers. It gives it a really nice crunch and some color. Then we're going to do red onions. And of course, you can add on whatever you'd like. And please do help me oh, so put delicious. this together. <laughs> All right, a little bit of mushrooms. And, and at what time and date will you actually take over running the country? Uh, <laughs> just checking. I want to make sure we're around for that, right? Go for Haley. Yes. Yes. Oh, for Haley. That's amazing. Now, this is the tofu chicken or the um, vegan chicken? Yes. So I really love preparing this in all sorts of different like ways. Chicken. It's really great it baked or pan mm. fried. And this recipe is also so kid friendly and you can just customize it any way you want and as a family you can get into the kitchen which is super important to me. So, all right, so you're going to bake that's so sweet. You guys all get together and do that. It is so sweet. I, I know I'm taking it home. I know you got to teach your uh, Coco how to I know. Bake. I want Coco to grow up to be you. Uh, <laughs> all right, so uh, we bake it. For yes, so we're going to send it in the oven and then 
Do you want to taste it? You get this beautiful. Yeah. 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 This beautiful finished product, and you can bake it for about 10 minutes or to whatever desired crispiness you'd like. And then you can just slice it up. And I think you guys have some yep. right there that we you can do. try. I want to ask you about happy. Yes. Not, yes. not the not emotional the song. state. Yeah, or the song. <laughs> or the song. Tell or me, Pharrell. What is happy? So Happy is an organization that I co-founded with my mom, and it's actually an acronym. It stands for Healthy, Active, Positive, Purposeful Youth. And so through Happy, we provide kids in underserved areas in my hometown, Tucson, Arizona, opportunities to learn about cooking and nutrition and fun physical activities, mm. and really how to implement that in their lives with their families and make it easy and affordable. Most of our classes are free. And so we really want to inform the community we have about what's important. Yeah. Well, we're going to be seeing a lot of you, I have a feeling. I mean, <laughs> yes. your books and everything. Yes. I, well, we're going to be voting for you in the next presidential election, <laughs> as a matter of fact, I think so. We need to change our, and uh, Mrs. Obama's great about this, getting mm -hmm. better foods in our schools. Mm -hmm. Like, this would be awesome. And you're yeah. a wonderful ambassador, too. Yeah. Thank, Thank you, you so much. This is wonderful. great. Mm -hmm. um,